Hello and welcome back to Let's Try. We're trying Vactix. This game isn't out yet, but I'm just trying the demo. Looks really cool. It uh, looks like they're going for a little bit of an Into the Breach successor. Simplistic mechanics, but fairly deep tactics. Um, let's give it a go. Oh no. Oh, I hate when this happens. Get in the robot, Shinji. We've powered the mech up. We should test out the movement system. Click a tile next to the mech to move there. Trees and buildings will block the mech from moving to a tile. A fighter Vactic has appeared. Scan the Vactic to learn what the, we are up against. Alright. The Vactic is next to your mech. You are in position for a strafe attack. Strafe attacks can trigger when the mech starts a move adjacent to a Vactic. Strafe attacks trigger automatically depending on the mech's movement. Okay. There we go. Simple enough. Kind of a reverse attack, attack of opportunity mechanic going on. I, I really like the, the kind of simplistic color palette. Solitude City is always changing shape. No district looks the same for long. To start the level, select a landing site. The mech will arrive with a shield to protect from the first attack. So we could like put it right here and then we could do a movement and attack. Oh, we can't attack two things at once. This guy is not attacking me. So he, his whole thing, okay, so this is kind of uh, reminding me a little bit of Hoplite, which was a, um, which is a roguelike on the phone, a really good one. This, uh, this has got, I, I really like these kind of games where they, it's basically chess. You have units that have very simple behavior, but when put together, it actually makes for a very strategic game. So I have to corner this guy is the only thing I can do. Yeah, there we go. I wonder if uh, maybe I'll get a ranged attack. Destroy all of Actics. So we probably want to destroy the melee ones first. Although, no, maybe not because, yeah, this guy can can reach us there. A Vactic is straight ahead of your mech. You are in a uh, position for a charge attack. Charge attacks can happen when the mech is positioned two tiles away from a Vactic. Right, okay, so we could we could move here. I don't... Oh, that's... You can attack two at once. What a move. Combos trigger when we destroy more than one Vactic in a turn. I thought that we couldn't do that. Combos recharge the mech power supply. The more kills in a combo, the more the power supply will recharge. Tech upgrades, we have liberated the district. A team has been following us to scavenge tech from defeated Vactics. When we complete a district, there will be a choice of tech to upgrade our te mech with. Select new mech tech. Uh, all right. Dash, oh, this is cool. Dash to a spot quickly, moving through anything in between. Prevents the target from taking any action until they thaw out. I like I like the dash. Let's let's give that a go. Um, all right, so I guess we're moving here. So every every tile comes in in three levels, basically. Oh, what are these guys? Oh, okay. So they have um, they're ranged, but they they have more flexibility. They can fire from pretty much anywhere. Let's try and uh, get rid of them like right away. Oh, uh, this is a problem. Oh no no, it's okay. So this guy can reach me now. I don't know what these things are. Oh, he was able to hit me. The mech has been damaged by an attack. We need to avoid this happening. Vactic attacks the mech and deplete our power supply. Each attack will deplete the power supply by 25. The mech power supply is reduced to zero. It is game over. Okay, so this is going to do more damage to me. Oh, okay, here we go. The problem is, is that I'm still not safe. This guy can reach me if I move over here to attack. So this is uh, this is really brutal right now, honestly. Okay, we can finally kill this guy. These guys can reach anywhere, but I'm pretty sure they can only throw a grenade. So it might be that uh, I'm actually not in danger when I move in their range. Either way, I'm gonna I'm gonna move closer to them. Oh, right, our turn doesn't end. Oh, uh, this is okay. Let's see what happens here. So they see they didn't do anything. They might also have a cooldown. Oh, there we go. Oh yeah. Okay. So it does have same kind of hoplite mechanic of like when you move straight towards an enemy, you'll do an attack. Kind of want to deal with this range unit right away, but they're gonna move this way, and that's gonna be a problem because I'm not gonna be able to actually deal with them. I don't know. I think we're just gonna get rid of one of these melee units. get rid of one of these guys 
Oh, the, the grenades also hurt the enemies. Oh, that's cool. So if, we should be able to kill this guy here. Yep. And uh, nice, nice little bit of conveyance for letting me know when that Vactic is ready to attack again. They do have a cooldown. Um, getting to know them is, is part of learning the game, I think. This is not ideal. Okay, so we should be able to kill two units here as well. Yep. Perfect. Let's kill this guy first. They're, they're going to be a problem. Nice. Okay, so I'm starting to get the hang of this. You do lose a little bit of energy every time you take a move that isn't basically doing a combo. So you are very incentivized for doing combos. Dash can now target hazard tiles such as fires. Interesting. Combo recharge. Dash cooldown is restored by one after a combo. Hazard tile recharge. Dash cooldown is restored by two when mech moves to a hazard tile. Well, that doesn't seem right because then I, I but I can't use this until I get hazard aim right uh, let's take combo recharge our scans of this district have detected the city AI has enabled the no friendly fire escalation protocol escalation protocols modify the rules of the game change your strategy to, to adjust to them you can review what escalation protocols are active by pressing the this button District escalations are also found on the this tab on the city map. These protocols are only active when playing the selected district. So what what is what are we looking at? No friendly fire, Vactics can no longer kill each other. Brutal. Uh, well that was a very clever move. Oh no, I should be able to kill two at once here. Nice. Let's do a dash. I think that this is th that was maybe not a good move. All right, let's move here. I should be safe there, and then I can kill. Oh, three here! Look at that, three kills. Oh, that was nice. Easy. Is the next uh, mission also gonna have no friendly fire? I wonder. Yes. So it's the it's the whole set of levels. So we'll be in range if I move over here, but it might be worth it. No, it's not gonna be worth it because I'm gonna take 25 damage. I should I should have prioritized. Let's um let's move over here so I can kill these ranged units. That's okay. They're not gonna take friendly fire unfortunately, but we're okay. We can we can kill this dude. Ow oh that was bad. That was dumb. Uh okay we can kill two here. Recover a little bit of our, our of our juice. Alright last last mission of this district. I'm just wondering if it's worth killing. If I can combo three, do you think it's worth taking one damage from this guy? I would say no. I would say that that was not worth it. I feel like you need to get rid of these ranged units like as quickly as possible. Well, that wasn't ideal. We're below half health now. You know, we're surviving. I like this a lot actually. It's it's it basically exactly what I wanted. It's it's a fairly simple premise, but it's got that chess tactics that I really liked about uh, Into the Breach. Dash can now target tiles with Vactics. I'll try Vactics aim. I'll see if that's better. Oh, we have three choices now. Okay, interesting. Danger zone, weaker combos, no friendly fire. More Vactics, heavy hitters. Tower fall, shielded opponents, recharge limit. Let's take let's take more Vactics. More Vactics may actually be a benefit to us in a way because then we can we can recover some of our energy. Oh man, okay, yes, but also this is a disaster. <laughs> oh my god. Let's start here and try and follow the plan. Oh god, can we go here? Yes, we can. I don't know if doing that was smart. We are going to take a hit here. There's no helping it. And in fact, we took two hits and that's the end. Okay, so more more Vactics is bad. The Vactics disabled the mech. We failed to save the city, but we can try again. Uh, mech body upgrade. The engine is now upgraded to support installing new tech with the range boost. The mech can now carry two types of tech. Okay, so we couldn't actually get any other kind of tech. Oh, we did get, unlock a new color palette. Yeah, I like that a lot. The technicians will rebuild the mech. We can then continue the fight to save the city. Select from the salvage to equip the next mech for battle. Select the tech, then select the install position. So we can just um, start with a dash, I guess? Again, I really like this color palette. Honestly, it's kind of a bold move to go with like 
gray as part of the palette, but it really works. I, I like it a lot. And we should be good to get two here. We'll dash towards this guy so we can kill him. And that, that way we only use up a little bit of energy instead of wasting a bunch. This guy's gonna waste a little bit of our time, but that's okay. We're gonna get a combo here. Definitely, I think you wanna prioritize the ranged units. And you definitely always wanna use your dash when it's made available because um, that's basically just a free turn. Dash to a spot quickly, move through any, hmm. We could get a second dash. Push arms, okay, let's, let's do that. All right, let's try and get rid of this guy like right away. Oh yeah, they do have alternating uh, cooldowns. Is this guy, okay, that guy can't reach me here, which is good. Oh, this is, well, no, it's not perfect. I was gonna say that this is pretty good, but we could do a double dash. Mario Kart double dash over there, and then uh, we should be able to, yeah, get a, get a free kill. Nice, okay, this is coming together. Oh, we're, we're good here, actually. I'm wondering, um, yeah, we could dash here. Oh no, that wouldn't work because then we'll take an attack from the melee user. So we'll just have to do a normal boring attack like that. I really wanna try and get more combos, but it's a little bit harder than you think. Combo recharge is good. Hazard aim, skip recharge. Uh, we'll take combo recharge. So I can, I can now choose the tech Oh, interesting. So I can choose the tech and then I can choose which one gets the upgrade. Okay, we'll make, I think the the, the wheel it literally says that it goes further and that's why I'm able to move um, that double tile. So let's see what we have here. Heavy hitters, oof. Energy tax, shielded opponent. L let's take heavy hitters. As long as we don't take any hits, it shouldn't ever be a problem. I guess I'll move here. It's the best I can hope for. Because if I move here, I can only move down and then this guy can hit me. If I move here i can kill this dude but that's you'd think with all of these enemies i could get any combo right yeah there's there's not a lot for me i guess i'll take take out it oh that guy died interesting i didn't realize that that was a, an option all right so now we can actually get a combo off here we'll kill this range unit we're almost at 100 health which is really great um oh look at all the range unit uh, users if I move here, no, this guy can reach me here. All right, well, we, we are good to kill this guy here. We're also good to kill this guy here. Yeah, we'll kill this dude. Okay, we should be able to make something nice happen here. So we're gonna dash here and then we'll get a combo off there. Perfect. And we're at 100%, look at that. I feel really good about that. Um, What do we wanna do here, I think? I'll move here. Unfortunately, they all get to move before I do. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, it's just the first attack that we, oh, I didn't realize that. I thought you get like a grace turn, but you totally don't. We almost just died right there. My God. All right, so we're gonna have to play a, a bit of recovery, unfortunately, but um, that's, that's gonna, that's just the reality of it. Dash range increased by one. Can we give that to the... the no, we can't give it to the, the other one because the other one's already got it. We can give this one um, combo recharge. I'll take combo recharge. I think they'll, they'll both have combo recharge now. Oh, what are these guys? These guys have a range. Dash is a cross level to attack mech. Oh, I see. They have... A, okay, so they have a charging attack. There's a lot of these guys. Um, finding a safe spot is going to be interesting. So I should be able to get three combos off. Unfortunately, I'm gonna be within range of one of these guys. Um, I think it's worth it. I think getting three is worth taking a hit. Um, kinda no, actually. All right, we'll just have to get just a, a base kill without without getting any combos. It, it really is just like all about the combos and not getting them hurts. We have 20% health left. 15, oh, the energy tax is actually nasty. If, like, I'm actually, like, if I don't get the combos, I'm going to die. Does that count? That didn't count. It actually taxes you at the last turn as well. Yeah, I don't know. Um, you really do have to set up those combos and I'm not sure how to do that properly. We have upgraded the mech cockpit to hold tech. The mech can carry three types of tech. Um, this technically is meta progression, but if it's 
just like the first couple of games that you're learning the, the strategies and the, the new um, mechanics that you, we have like just a distinct advantage on the, on the third or fourth game. Uh, that's okay. I don't mind that so long as it doesn't feel like you have to unlock like a bunch of tech down the road in order to actually pr like properly play the game. Let's try, we'll try the grappling hook. All right, let's try, let's try a grappling hook. Grappling hook. Can we kill this guy by throwing him in the fire? Yes. And I believe that's a free turn so we don't actually lose any energy. You occasionally find yourself in situations where you don't really have much you can do. You just have to kind of move away until we get more abilities that offer us a bit more flexibility. So we could get dash again. I would like to get dash. Fire aspect. Grappling hook leaves fires behind. Oh, interesting. Pull Vactix towards the mech. Again, we could get another grappling hook. Let's try faster dash. Also, I really appreciate that all of these different techs do change the look of your character. Surrounding Vactix are pushed away. That could be okay, because we do have the grappling hook. We could just bring them back. Kill that ranged unit there, I guess. Times two combo, 10% power gained. Did that, kill, did that kill a count as a, a combo? I didn't, I didn't see it. Where was the combo? If I kill a unit by moving through a tile, does that count towards a combo? There's a lot of things going on in this game, but um, it doesn't like, you don't feel bogged down. It's just, it really, it's just kind of a simple chess strategies. I guess I'm taking a bunch of damage this turn. Oh, that didn't, what are these? We'll dash here, and I think that'll count as another combo. That did count as a combo. Okay, so dashing through units actually counts towards a combo because technically it is part of the same turn. I didn't realize that. That that actually helps a lot. I'm, I'm also learning a lot more this this time. I'm, this third game uh, is really teaching me about a lot more. Fast dash cooldown reduced by two turns. Okay, yeah. I wonder if I could have put that on the grappling hook. Oh, I see. Oh, so the two tiles that we chose not to take are now now a thing we have to deal with and they're worse. Larger districts, that could be manageable. Oh, I see, larger districts doesn't mean larger levels. It means you have more levels. So I just chose poorly, I think. All right, it's okay. We've got quite a lot of stuff going for us right now. This is actually a great combo and I think I can do it safely. We can kill this guy. Oh no, we can't kill him for free. Unfortunately, we can move back one. And I think that would be safe. Okay, we won't get a combo safely here, unfortunately. All right, I guess I'll da dash over this enemy just just for safety, and I'll move over here. I'm not sure what these things do. I to be honest, I can bring this guy over. Oh, it it pushes it pushes everything away. Oh, okay. This is actually kind of great. We'll kill this guy and then we'll kill both of these guys for free. And that'll give us quite a bit of our health back. Nice, that went really well. We recovered quite a lot of health from that. Wow, okay, we have like basically no options. I guess I, I gotta move here. It's the only safe spot. Oh God. Well, this is actually great because um, we can move through two enemies here and then get a third enemy. Although uh, this guy can reach me there, so it might be better to just move. Oh, we could do another dash. Oh, perfect. And then kill, a f what is that, five enemies now or four? All oh, those grenades killed so many off. So you get 20% power from a uh, four combo. We could we could dash again and then kill off two. So that we, we killed four in that one and we're at 100% power. You know you're doing something right when. Yeah, those combos, the, these dashes are really nice. They offer a lot of flexibility. Oh, this guy can reach us here, so it's actually not as good as I thought. Can we do anything about this? We can grapple this guy over. Does that move that guy over? Now we'll get a, we'll get a combo where we wouldn't have gotten it before, and we're back to 100% health. Okay, we just need to do a safety move. Although we can do a dash. Yeah, I mean the dashes really do help a lot. Although this didn't really get us anything. It didn't get us combo. 
I've already been playing this game for an hour. It's it's this is a really good one. I, I really enjoy this. I think if I move down, it's actually totally safe and we'll kill like three. No, this guy's gonna get us. Might still be worth it. No, I don't think it's ever worth taking a damage. So instead, I think I'll move through two, two, two units here and kill two of them off. We can't grapple, unfortunately. The grapple has a range, which is pretty brutal. So I'll just move one and that'll be enough. Oh, wow. So range units can kill each other. I didn't know. So what we can do here, I mean, we end, it, we end up using a lot of our abilities, but we'll grapple and then dash and then, um, oh, this guy can reach us there and this guy can reach us there. So we end up getting nothing after all. All right, well, that's fine. Wow, this is really nasty. We're basically in a situation where I can't do anything and we take a damage. <laughs> Yeah, this is, this is not going well. Okay, this might be better. Okay, we'll start by dashing through this guy and then we'll just walk back and we'll kill three units in one turn. That's, that's pretty good. I'll accept that. This guy will die. And we'll use a dash just to save us a bit of energy. All right, so that, that's the district done. Combo recharge, faster hazard tile recharge. Grappling hook cooldown is restored by two when mech moves to a hazard tile. Dash cooldown is restored by five when turn is skipped. I still don't know how to skip my turn. Uh, combo recharge on the grappling hook, maybe. It's not not the you know a really game changing upgrade considering how difficult of district we we just beat. I, I, I'm enjoying this. I think I would actually consider doing a series on this when the game fully comes out. It didn't even occur to me. This is a demo. <laughs> I've been playing this for like an hour and I haven't even seen any limitations. Honestly, I don't even know if this is a good move. It feels good. Oh, can this guy reach me now? Yes. Oh, so pushing away range units is actually really bad. Because then they can reach you when they normally couldn't have. I wonder if I move here, will it push these guys into the building? And then will they be able to reach me then? Oh, nothing happens. But that experiment cost me quite a lot. Okay, I feel like we could make something interesting happen here. No, actually no. No, we have like nothing. No combos available to us there. Ah, uh, surely something now, right? Uh, we're just gonna have to play it safe. Oh, these guys, there's no friendly fire. Oh, wow. And I am now going to die. There's actually nothing I can do. There's nothing I can do. Oh, brutal. Okay, well, that's gonna do it for Vactix. This is a really cool game. It's, it's really brutally difficult. Um, maybe we can see what new tech we unlocked. I might honestly like to see it, uh, this game with a, a no meta mode, just like give me the, all of the tech right away. But I mean, that's just me, again, kind of disliking the meta progression because I'm not really keen on the idea of like, well, I couldn't beat it this, this playthrough because I didn't have this tech. So this is um, not been able to duplicate, allows mechs to move instantly to another location. So this is like techno uh, teleport technology. New color palette, looks really cool actually. Um, this is Vactix, I still really like this and I, I would uh, definitely like to check out more of it when the game fully launches in about a month. Uh, if you enjoyed this, definitely hit that like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. I'll see you guys next time, take it easy. Thank you.